what if I were to tell you the story of a few brave men? A few brave men whom under enormous pressure did something that no one else could do. If you were to ask me what my definition of a hero is, I would tell you that my definition of a hero was someone who strapped on their boots at every opportunity to do some good in this world. You don't find too many guys like that anymore, but they're out there. They're out there on the front lines, giving their all for the people they love a thousand miles away. And what are we doing here right now? Wasting time while the people who are preparing to provide a more perfect union are fighting for their lives. Now don't mistake me. The actions that we take here right now are more important than any war we'll have to fight. It doesn't matter how many guns, bombs, tanks, airplanes they throw at us, if we don't let them break us apart, united we stand is what I used to believe when I was growing up. If we play into the divisiveness of our own culture, then we are suited to fall into the abyss of a much more dangerous kind of monotony. The one where the war is here, right at home. When the sons don't come home to their fathers. When the bleeding hearts broke so long ago that there's not a song in the world that can make them feel whole again. When the policies and the politics don't matter because the only thing that does is when your next meal is. If we triumph over the evil and hatred that has fallen upon us, I firmly believe that our perfect union will hold us into the future. But if we let the hogs and the demagogues of those who would oppress us keep us down, then you can expect the beating of a lifetime when they have too much time to prepare and you didn't have enough time to think. Don't be like them. Be like these few brave men. These few brave men who under enormous pressure did something that no one else could do sacrifice their lives in some meaningful way for the betterment of their equal.